Bibi means lady in Swahili and woman in Urdu. The Bibi crew was to give it, you know, some kind of um, street cred. Yeah, street credibility. <laughs> The BB Crew was formed after a memorial benefit took place here at the Theatre Royal Stratford East to celebrate the life of the actor Calvin Simpson. A couple of us were in that and we decided that it may be a good idea to try and form a group. And we discussed ourselves, we you know, talked about our childhood memories and growing up and some of us were brought up in London, some were brought up in Northampton, or one in Northampton, one in Wales. But Across the border, we had very similar experiences, which we all jotted down and decided that, yeah, we could do a show. Why are you wearing that on your nose? What's it for? My mummy says it's going to make my nose straight and not big and flare out. I have to wear it every day. And when I take it off, I have to do this. What's wrong with you? What are you trying to do that to you on your spot? Starting with childhood, On a Level presents a series of sketches which traces the experience of being a black woman through every stage of development. We are really relating directly to a black audience culturally, but the material, I think, is very universal. You come out of drama school, you play a certain amount of um, standard classic roles, and then all of a sudden, unless somebody is putting on a West Indian play or an American play with a black American in it, you're, there's hardly anything to really challenge you. The it, films like How Do They Come and Rockers, which were Jamaican films, or films made in Jamaica, with obviously their Jamaican dialects, and um, they'd have the subtitles underneath. And we'd be listening to them, and you'd watch the subtitles, you'd say, what? That's not what they're saying. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the ridiculousness of it. And so we, we like the idea of that. When Gautier cut off, got on my brush fly. He's got a long tongue. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Oh, no. Knock us alligator long moat till you cross the river. By the way, how's your Bertie? The question now is, where next for the BB crew? It shouldn't be unique at all. And one of the disgraces of British theatre, quite frankly, is that there's only one producing theatre in this country which produces its own shows with black people in charge. And it's nowhere near enough. It's just, it should be part of the British way of life. I think it's the, it's the biggest gap in British theatrical life. You didn't know that, did you?